Welcome to the tip of the week. This week's topic is Google Drive, saving files. Have you ever experienced a hard drive failure? This is a devastating issue because you will lose all the files you save to your hard drive or desktop. This includes files saved locally to your documents folder and your desktop. To avoid this issue, you should be saving all your files to Google Drive, the cloud storage solution for most state agencies. To save files that are not created in the Google Apps, you will need to install Google Drive for Desktop. Please refer to the tip of the week, How to Install Drive for Desktop, located on our YouTube channel. Let's look at how to save a new file and an existing file to Google Drive. For an existing file, open your file explorer. It will be the file icon in the taskbar at the bottom of your screen. Go to the location of the file that you want to save to Google Drive. Right click on the file and click either cut or copy Cut will delete the file from the original location. Copy will put a copy of the file in a new location. Click Google Drive in the list of drives to the left. If Google Drive is not present, you may need to install Drive for Desktop or open Drive for Desktop from your Start menu. Double click on My Drive, right click in the white area of the screen and click Paste. Note you can create a folder and paste the file in the folder as well, or you can place it in an existing folder. For a new file, once you finish creating your document, click the File tab. Click Save As, click This PC, under where you will choose the format you want to save in, click More Options, click Google Drive in the list of drives to the left, double click on My Drive, Change the name of the file if you wish to, and click Save. Note that you can also create a folder and save the file in it, or save it to an existing folder. Also, in both situations, depending on your network connection, it can take up to 20 minutes for the file to sync to your Google Drive account. Do you have questions about using Google Workspace? There are several resources available. The links and contact information are listed here.